And welcome back to Good Day Sacramento. I am Jordan Segunda. We've got a lot of wonderful volunteers working hard this morning, getting meals prepared for some folks who will be coming out here to St. Vincent to Paul of Roseville to pick up some much needed items, especially some food items here. It's a wonderful service that they've been doing for the last 40 years, but the work will continue and it's gonna continue with your help. This morning we're here with Rebecca. Thanks so much for joining us. I know some of the volunteers have come in early this morning. Tell us what's happening here and how important services like this are. Uh, is are for the community. So today we have a drive through food distribution and what's happening here this morning is that um, all of our grocery carts are being filled. We will have up to roughly 120 households come through here in two hours and each family will receive a full cart of groceries um, hoping to supplement their food budget for the week. They can come here every week and receive a grocery cart full of groceries. I mean, this is wonderful. We're seeing the shelves filled with food items. And when you think about it, you know, some families, they're struggling to even put food on the table, but you guys have been helping people out for over 40 years, right? That's correct. We've been here since 1983. And um, our mission here is to prevent hunger and homelessness. So our hope is that if we can help put food on the table, um, then families can use their hard-earned money to, to supplement their groceries, go their grocery budget, and um, then use that money for other, other things like rent and utilities. Right, and we know, you know, in this day and age, it's a little bit of a struggle. We're gonna step out here because we're seeing a lot of these wagons already filled with carts now. Here at uh, St. Vincent, this is just one program that you guys offer. Not only do you guys give out food, but you guys also have our uh, rental assistance, right? We do have rental and utility assistance all funded by grants and this year we are providing upwards of $250,000 in services to the community. Oh, that's wonderful. I, th Rebecca, thank you so much. I want to bring in Tom here. This is the founder of this wonderful organization. Tom, you guys are having a big fundraiser happening this weekend. It's going to help you guys bring in more funds, more money for your program so that it can continue to help out the, the local community. Tell us all about it because there's a fun theme about this weekend's organization uh, fundraiser, right? Yes, our theme is don't stop believing. It's an 80s music uh, theme, um, and we think it really hits our stride in that we started in 1983, and it's an important milestone for us. It's our 40th anniversary, and we'll be honoring one of our co-founders who passed away last year, Father Michael Cormack. This, you know, this fun, wonderful fundraiser again will not only honor him but also raise money for this organization. And you guys do a lot of work for the for the families out there. Now, people who are watching this and think, you know, I, I might need some help, and they might be a little embarrassed to reach out. How can people get connected with you guys and, and utilize your services? They just need to present to our office, and we'll have them fill out a form, and and it's a very simple thing to do. And there's welcome to come and use it. And, save their money for their groceries so they can pay their other bills. Well, there you go. Again, St. Vincent de Paul of Roseville. They are busy at work this morning. But again, if you would like to help their organization, they're having a big fundraiser this Saturday. All the information up on your screen. But if you're someone at home that might need a little bit of help, don't be afraid. Reach out to them as well because you know what? We're all here to help one another out and this organization is here for you. So all the information will be up there. Good Tom, way. Rebecca, and all of our volunteers, thank you all so much. We appreciate all the work that you guys are doing here this morning. Back to you guys in the studio.